In my lab, we're interested in um, determining the basic molecular mechanisms for neurodegeneration. We use primarily a Huntington's disease model in fruit flies. I was immediately drawn towards Dr. Pierce's lab just because neurodegenerative diseases are such a big field right now and everyone's worried about it because of the aging population that we have in the United States and all over the world. One huge advantage of fruit flies is we get to study these questions in an in vivo model or in a living model. The reason we use that is because fruit flies have numerous genetic tools that we can use to investigate these types of questions in the brain. So we recently received an NIH grant that's focused on studying underlying mechanisms for Alzheimer's and related disorders. The goal is not only to publish the findings in a peer-reviewed journal, but also to use the data that we obtain to apply for even larger NIH or other sources of grant funding. Even though we're looking at something very small, such as a fruit fly, the things that we learn are actually going to help us find better results and better treatments for ultimately humans.